wonderful to have the woman of the hour here with us, of course, and her family. So um, about a year ago, Conchetta approached us wanting to do some artwork for the hospital. And it's like, okay, wow, where do we put this? And we knew the orthopedic department was new and had a lot of bare walls. So um, we found these two spots, and they're great because right as you walk into this area, you see it. So it's just a real focal point, and I know she did these in a weekend, which is <laughs> unbelievable. I don't know how. I'm Conchetta Antico, and I am a professional artist and an instructor. My goal is to bring art to the world, and this is a small piece of that goal. Uh, I'd always wanted to do that ever since I was very little. And uh, to bring joy through art and to bring healing through art. To place healing art before the eyes and in the hearts of those that need comfort. And so this is why I titled it in this way. Believe is because we always have to have hope. No matter what adversity, no matter what happens to us, hope is something that we need to always believe in. Animals, along with eucalyptus and a feeling of the great outdoors on a sunny day, will help you escape. So you can't say I haven't given you some clues in here. Finally, I added color, and that is my signature. Some of you may or may not know, I am a tetrachromat. I was gifted with this, blessed with it at conception. I have four receptors in my eyes instead of three. What that means is that there's no surprise that I have always immersed myself in the beauty of our world because it speaks to me so clearly. There is so much color and beauty in our world and I can't help but want to share what I see with you on the canvas. In this painting you'll see families of things that are together and bringing love and sharing something. How did I come up with the subject matter? What was my vision for belief? Intrinsically or initially the idea was to be a sort of a cathartic beacon of joy. I hope to have the opportunity to produce more beautiful work for ladies of whom I support with every painting that I saw. Thank you. And our staff, like our patients, sometimes have a little anxiety, <laughs> maybe a teeny bit of stress. Um, but they're really here to help the kids. And so when you think about it, you know, if our staff can have those moments to just reflect or maybe, you know, escape, escape you know, I mean, just think what that means to them and then what that means to the next kid they're going to see. Thank you. Because they'll be just that much more composed and ready to be able to help. So this is phenomenal for us and to have this kind of thing because it you know we can only go so far this becomes the capstone to the to the place. Well right. bless you and thank yeah. you. Well, awesome. Thank you again. Thank you. And this will be great. I hope as I say this is the beginning oh, of Oh yeah. Of We've got another one. It's on the <laughs>